Oh, okay. Uh, what I'm doing right now is I'm showing you on the 18th of May how many megabytes have been used on my phone. And as you can see, only 2623.39 megabytes. Data allotment, unlimited me megabytes. And what I'm going to do now is minimize this and go to YouTube. And show you how YouTube is oops how YouTube is hanging it started doing this last night watch okay this is showing you what today's date is to prove that it's only three days after my phone service the new monthly payments uh, I'm only three days into my new monthly payment 6.51 a.m. Last night about 11.30 it started acting up again and doing this again. Okay. And, uh, I made a prediction a day or two before I made my payment on the 10th that let's see if they if, if starting I believe that this phone is hacked so I made a prediction in an audio file let's see uh, if they start screwing around with my phone in reference to it working correctly and four days later after I made my payment on the 10th okay so you can see that it's not even accessing this YouTube video so what I'm going to do is go back to in fact it's not even See, it's not even it's not even readjusting to YouTube to the beginning. Okay, it's, uh, it says YouTube isn't responding. Do you want to close it? Okay, I'm gonna say okay. So what they're doing is screwing around with my connection, with my connections. Now, when I turned on the phone, this three gigabyte thing wasn't here. It, it, it's it, now it's saying now it just disappeared again it's, uh, two seconds ago the the see how it's the bars are clicking back and forth okay so what it's doing is it's 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 uh, intentionally not letting me sign into uh, it's intentionally jamming up my YouTube videos. So, uh, I'm going to go back into here, press YouTube, and watch how it's acting. Now, I got unlimited data and web usage. So, this is just a YouTube video I'm selecting. Watch how it, watch how it works. Now, as a result of it screwing around on the 14th or 15th of... Uh, this month, which was just two days ago, I called them and they said that they uh, they tried to claim that I went over my data usage amount or, or that I used so much data. When my wife told me we were staying at a cabin in Lakeside, Arizona, I figured on a small cabin with just enough space to sleep all of us, three adults and four children. But I was surprised upon checking into Lake of the Woods. See, it's breaking up already. See? Now, I don't know how this phone service, uh... Resort ...to find a cabin with three rooms, six double beds, a full kitchen, dining room, and living room, only ten yards away from a Watch, small it's lake. It's gonna keep spinning. Lake of the Woods has a lot to offer visitors of all ages, and I would recommend it for any... See? This, this is what it's doing since 11.30 last night. Now, I got unlimited, uh... I got unlimited web. Anyone who wants to get away for a relaxing mountain vacation. The lake attracts lots of wildlife, including bald eagles, blue heron, and ducks. And you don't need a and fishing data. license, since it's a private lake. On site, there is... Okay, this is what it's doing to every YouTube video that comes up. I got unlimited data and web, 300 minutes, uh, 300 talking minutes. 
I don't call anyone. Boating, so. shuffleboard, ping pong, pool, and horseshoes. Close by is excellent hiking and lots of other outdoor activities. One of my daughters went horseback riding. Okay, see how it's breaking up? Uh, and then trying to restart constantly. This is what it does ever since 11.30 last night. Constant, constant the woods breaking located up. located at 2244 White Mountain Road, a few miles east of Sholo. Obviously, there are various sized cabins for various sized parties, and the staff is gracious and accommodating. It's worth a phone call to inquire about reservations. We plan to stay again there soon. Now you just seen where you just seen a dialog box come up that said YouTube isn't responding. Now last night from 11:30 up until about one o'clock, it was totally it wouldn't allow me to listen to anything except for a steep. You can wear leather gloves if you want, but if you're actually careful. You don't need to. What I do is I'm going to take a bundle of grasses. I'm going to reach down. I'm going to gently just place my hand around the bundle. See? This is what it's doing to every video. And it continually hangs. It doesn't correct itself or nothing. So I'm going to call him again today. I'm going to give it a little twist again. so I know where my bundle I'm going to, I just turned it off. I'm going to call him again today. And we're going to see if this phone service, which is Virgin... Okay, it's an Android phone. Uh, Virgin is its um, is its service provider. We're gonna see when I call them today if they start saying, "Well, you've only had this phone a month and a half, and now you're calling us for the third time." Maybe it's best that you that you uh, choose another service, or just keep doing this to my phone until I just to motivate me to choose another service. Now, why am I saying all this? I'm a target victim and activist concerning the criminal expeditions of what is known as organized stalking. The term, uh, this crime can also be called gang stalking. Go to Google and go to YouTube and type in cell phone hacking and gang stalking and or organized stalking. And extensively research what comes up and the amount of Google generated responses that come up. Now this is their way, I already know this phone's hacked because of other things that I've experienced with it. Okay. This is their way to try and motivate me to continually call this service and eventually maybe even have the service say, well, we, pr we would prefer not to have you as a customer because you keep calling up and complaining. Now, they supposedly reset my account balance and then tried to say that they hadn't processed my payment. And so as a result, they moved my payment date up to the 15th and then uh, reactivated the phone service. I paid them on the 10th right on the day the payment was due and then I and then I came down with a migraine for a couple days didn't use the phone practically at all I mean I think I just booted it up to check my email real fast and then turned it back off because I was debilitated with migraine for two full days the phone went down on the night of the 14th and so when you look at it, I made the payment on the and then when I made the payment on the 10th I barely used the phone that day because I went to a university all day on the 11th, I went to a public library and was there and running around all day, so I barely used it on that day. The 12th and the 13th is when I came down with the, uh, the migraine, didn't use it at all. And then the uh, night of the 14th is when it went down, so I called them on the 15th. And then they tried to say that I went over uh, 3 gigabytes of, of, my, of uh, data, uh, 3 gigabytes of, of data, even though I got unlimited data and web accessibility and 300 minutes of uh, phone call time. So why is it hanging again? So then they turned around and said, well, they, 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 it's happening because they didn't process my payment. And so they activated my new payment plan from the 15th of each month from the 10th of each month. That was two days ago. Now, since then, the only time I really used my phone was on the 15th. Uh, that night because I spent the 15th during a day at a university library and then yesterday which was and then yesterday I used it quite a little bit now I just showed you an account overview okay which I'm gonna go back to right now 
and the account overview is seen. Uh, oh, hold on. Now again, the account overview is saying that I've only used 2623.39 megabytes, unlimited megabytes. But yet, let's go into the. Uh, uh, now it's saying data speeds may be reduced at 255, 255, uh, 2560 meg megabytes, and uh, but that's just the speed. That's not the. That's not the. Uh, uh, that, that's just the amount of time it might take for a YouTube video to come up. That's not the actual YouTube videos being interrupted. Okay, or and then check out what happens when I go to get into my email. Okay. Uh, this I keep getting these data usage warnings. Check this out. Look what it's saying here. They never ever. They tried to say that I used between May 11th and 18th. They tried to say that I used 5.81 gigabytes. <laughs> that's that's in in from. They still didn't readjust it because they were supposed to readjust my cycle from the 10th to the 15th. When they said they finally re uh, processed my payment that I made on the 10th, okay. But there's no way that I used 5.5.81 uh, gigabytes between May 11th and the 18th. Cause check this out: when I first bought this phone on March 10th, 2014, uh, up until about three days before, uh, up until about April 6th or 7th, okay, 2014, which was almost a full month. After I bought it, I was using YouTube video practically every single day on a huge scale. Okay, uh, went over my supposedly uh, three gigabytes that's allowed to be used, even though I got unlimited data, unlimited web and data, and I didn't have no problems with YouTube at all. Now all of and why didn't they readjust this? They're saying from May 11th to the 18th that I've used six gigabytes, and what? Who cares anyways? I got unlimited web and data. So let's see how long it takes for me to get to my email account. And right now what I'm going to do is go back to the uh, internet and it's it, I access this after I had just, well, see I just woke up. So as soon as I woke up and, you know, woke, actually woke up, you know, like wash my face and stuff for a second. I then went to go after I went and ex tried to access a YouTube video and seeing that I was having the same problem that it, that started last night about 11:38 p.m. Uh, I went then to my Gmail to try and activate that and it's still spinning. So I'm going to call them and we're going to see what kind of bullshit that they give me. Okay, and we're also going to try and see if they say that well maybe you might not be uh, that maybe you might not want this service and that we'll refund your money. And then if they correct it again, we're going to see how long it takes before it happens again. Now again, go to go, and I told them, because I had to call them, uh, I had to call them a few nights before I made my, my phone service, because I was watching a, a video, a video series, and the, and the video volume was working fine. And then when I continued to watch a bunch of different videos, it was a TV series that's online now. And I was watching a few of their videos, and the volume on YouTube was fine. And then all of a sudden, the volume on YouTube—you could barely hear the YouTube uh, the YouTube videos pertaining to that video series. So I called them at that time. Okay. And they said that there was there was no way that they can control the fact that I can't access YouTube's volume control. So I said, okay. Then when I went to Radio Shack to make my payment on the 10th, I made an inquiry to them about that, and they said the same thing. So I just said, well, screw it. I'll just stop watching that series. Now you can see that my email is still hanging. Okay. That's right, baby cakes. So, again, go to Google, go to YouTube, type in organized stalking or gang stalking and or gang stalking and research how they can hack into your cell phone. Okay. And hack into your service. Okay. And why, why are they still claiming that I've used 6 gigabytes between May 11th and May 18th? Alright, so finally the mail has come up. Okay? But this is the bullshit that I'm going through. Which is also, while this shit's trying to get connected, it's using up all my power cells. 
All right, so let's see how many days in a row that I got to call this phone service, Virgin, to correct problems that transpire. Let's see how many times in this one month uh, from May 10th, 2014 till June 10th, 2014. Let's see how many times I have to call Virgin to get my phone uh, fixed in reference to it screwing around and disconnecting my, uh, you know, like when I go to try to watch a YouTube video, I can't watch it because it's continually spinning. I'm getting ready to call them after I have a uh, morning cigarette. All right, thank you.